everyone, it's me Dolly and I have a very exciting video today. It's exciting for me because I get to eat lots of chocolate and all before I start Slimming World so shh, this doesn't count. Look at it all! Okay, so this is a brand called Conscious Chocolate and what it is, is raw chocolate so it is dairy free, soya free, gluten free and free from refined sugars. And the lady who created these created them because she wanted a treat that wasn't full of junk and didn't have any nasties in and other people could enjoy it as well and it completely took off. I know it's available online and these are actually made pretty locally to me. So what is raw chocolate? Raw chocolate is basically what it says in the tin. It is raw chocolate. So if for example we look at the ingredients in the plain Jane with a 70% cacao, there are one, two, three, four, five, six, seven ingredients. Seven ingredients in a chocolate bar, suitable for vegans, it's suitable for those who are lactose intolerant and gluten intolerant, those who are diabetic because it is naturally sweetened. This one is naturally sweetened with agave nectar. So we have all these wonderful flavours to try today. I'm not going to eat the whole bar I want, so I'm just going to try a bit of each. There are lots of other options available on the website as well, which I will link below. And the only flavour I have tried myself of these is the chilli one, and we all know how that turned out last time because I, I cannot stand chilli. I like sweet chilli, but if it's hot chilli, someone just walked past and looked in the window like, is that girl talking to herself? So the way I'm going to try these is just go through my wonderful chocolate rainbow and do it that way. So the first one I'm going to start with is Lion's Raw, which is 60% cacao and it also donates 10% of profits to the Global White Lion Protection Trust. And this one contains essential oils of lemon, grapefruit and lime, naturally sweetened with rice syrup. So I don't know how I feel about citrus chocolate. I always think there's a time and a place for citrus and it's usually with Pepsi Max. Let's have a look, it just flips open. Oh, so this tells you a little bit about the donation and about the white lions. <laughs> this one feels a bit deformed, but I like different things. So on the packet we've got a picture, and this is the woman who actually created it and her little daughter. And of course a cute doggy. And it's got the Conscious Love Story. Conscious Chocolate is a love story that started in our kitchen with a wooden spoon and a desire for a chocolate that is healthy as well as heavenly. We promise to use only ethically sourced, raw, organic, premium ingredients. Each bar is lovingly made by hand with every recipe being a love story itself. And it says, enjoy Emma. I absolutely love that these are all handmade, like that's so rare. And I did a little bit of research and they're all packaged by hand as well. So like, it's all literally like so homemade. It's fantastic, it's so nice. So, let's open it. I think this one must have got a little bit warm. Oh my God, this smells so good. I don't really know how to explain that, but I'd wear that as a perfume. It's like, you can really smell the citrus in that. Oh, it smells so good. Okay, so let's try a bit of this. It's a really buttery consistency. It's like melting in my hand. Look at my fingers. Oh my God, that's just melting in my mouth. It just tastes so clean to eat. I don't know how to explain that. It just tastes like, you know, usually when you eat chocolate and it like gets up your mouth and you're just like, yeah, 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 yeah. This one literally like, that just melted in my mouth straight away. I can really taste the grapefruit, and I'm not really a fan of grapefruit, but it kind of works with the lemon in that. I'm not sure if I'd choose this one again, but I'm happy that I've tried it. On to the next one, and this one is called Coconut Crunch. And this one is actually sweetened with rice syrup, 60% cocoa solids, and this has chia seeds, coconut chips, and pumpkin seeds. I'm a sucker for pumpkin seeds, so I'm excited. I want to show you how this breaks because it's so truffly. Look, it's just such a soft, soft break. Look at that, you can see the seeds inside it. Oh my gosh, it's literally like a truffle. Let's try this one. I would go for this one again. I would instantly go for this one again. Mm -hmm. Oh my God, that is so good. Mmm. It's weird, I can't really taste the coconut, but I can find those chia seeds and the pumpkin and it's got a gorgeous, delicate taste. Oh my God, I love that. I can eat that whole bar. Okay, so the next one we've got Simply Saintly. Again, rice syrup sweetened, organic raw chocolate, and I think this is just plain 60% cocoa solids. So sort of a dark chocolate, but not massively dark for those who are not that keen on it. I've never smelt chocolate like this so good and I've never tasted chocolate like this where it's so smooth like my mouth isn't like funny or anything like 
I'm really surprised. Oh, look at that. Look at that. So, Simply St. A. Is that angels I hear singing? Oh my god! It's so good. I'm never going to be able to eat normal chocolate again. They keep talking in my mouth, which is really disgusting. I never do that. I'm doing it still. Mm. It's just so good that I can't wait to tell you. <laughs> I can totally see what it's called. Simply Saintly. Dang it. Okay, I'm excited for this one as well. Look at my chocolatey fingers. Mint hint, 65% cacao. And this is with essential oil of peppermint. Oh, I can already kind of smell the mint. That literally has like such an after eight smell. Here, take a smell. I wish it was smelly vision right now. I wish you could smell this. Look at that. Look at that truffle. I love truffles. And the fact that every single one of these is so truffly, it's amazing. Oh my God. I've never tasted mint chocolate like that. Oh my God. I'm salt. I'm completely sold, like, nothing's ever going to be so good again. I'm sorry, Aero, we're over. The mint is just so, it's intense, but it's not too intense. It's actually amazing. Considering how much chocolate I've eaten, my mouth is still not, like, rank or anything. My mouth feels so clean still, it's insane. Like, usually you just be like, ugh. It feels so fresh. So fresh, so clean. Next up is Cranberry Kiss. This is with Wild Cranberries, 60% cocoa solid. And I can never work out if I like cranberries or not, so we'll give it a go. So satisfying breaking these open. Cracking. So I can see the cranberries in this. Oh my God, look at it. Look how perfect it is. Okay. Emma from Conscious Chocolate, you're an absolute genius because I don't usually like fruit chocolates, usually they're the ones that I'm like, ew. This is insane, my chocolatey fingers. That's how like smooth it is, it just melts in your hand. So imagine how much it melts in your mouth. Oh my God. Amazing. Okay, so we've got essential orange. We have essential oils of orange and tangerine. The way this is going, I'm never going to be able to go near Terry's chocolate orange again because I feel like this is going to be amazing as well. I went into this thinking, that, oh my god, I'm not going to like it. And I mean, I love chocolate. I love that you can tell they're handmade as well. That never gets old. Oh, you can really smell the orange in that. It smells insane. Oh my god, that is the best orange chocolate I've ever tasted in my life. It's ruining all of the chocolates for me, but it's worth it. I'm sold. I'm sold to raw chocolate. The feel of my chocolate fingers is almost orgasmic. Okay, essential orange is in the lead right now. It's so good. We've got Plain J next, which is a darker chocolate again. 70% cacao. It smells very similar to the Simply Say E1, but I think it's because they haven't got anything else in it. It's just the cacao. It's a tougher break that one. Still so truffy and still melting in my fingers. <laughs> Your geniuses. Your actual geniuses. I wish you guys were tasting this with me. I'm gonna have to do a lot of exercise, but oh my god. Oh my god. So good. Okay, so next up, and I'm really excited by this one. I love the sound of the name. It is Love Potion number nine. A little bit of conscious in my life. A little bit of chia seeds by my side. So this one is with maca and essential oil of rose. Don't know what maca is, so if anyone knows, feel free to comment it down below. I forgot to Google it. So this one has a real Turkish delight smell, which I guess makes sense. I need to found out the other day that Turkish delight is actually rose scented. So I'm a bit concerned about this one because I don't actually like Turkish delight at all. So we'll try it. If you like Turkish Delight, you'd love this, but it's very Turkish Delighty. Not so much a fan of that one. Okay, so we've got three left to try. The next one I'm gonna go for is the Goji and Coconut. 
So goji and coconut, 70% cacao, and it is with goji berries and coconut chips. I can't smell the coconut in it, but again, it smells amazing. Yes! Oh my gosh, that's probably a close second to the essential orange, because that is damn good, and I can actually taste the coconut in this one. Just having a moment of bliss. Okay, so onto the two darkest of the bunch, we've got intense and the dark side. We're gonna start intense. Oh, you can smell that that's a darker chocolate. Slightly darker in colour as well, which you expect. Slightly less of a truffly break, but still so truffly and still melting in my fingers. So let's try. This is witchcraft. How is this all so good? How is it so good? Like, I'm not just saying this. This is so, so good. Slightly more of a grainy feel with this one, like whereas the others are a lot smoother, but it's good. It's a real nice dark chocolate. I feel like this would be really nice, like melted down into a hot chocolate or like melted into a cake or something. I feel like it'd be really good for cooking or drinking that one. Okay, so onto the final one before I go lay down in a chocolate coma. We're onto the Darth Vader of the raw chocolate with 85% cocoa solids. This is gonna be strong. Oh, that smells intense. That was the toughest break yet, and that snaps more like you'd expect chocolate to behave. I don't know if I'm ready for this. That is bitter. Ooh, that one is a bit too intense for me. Jeez, oh, if you like your chocolate strong and dark and handsome, this is the one for you. That was just a bit too powerful for my liking. So in conclusion, for my first proper time of trying lots of variations of raw chocolate, I'm sold and I really think you should try it too if you've not tried it. Or if you have dietary requirements and you're looking for a good chocolate to have, like if you're diabetic and you're sick of all the sugar-free, like standard stuff you get in shops, you can order this online. I will leave the link down below and the lovely people at Conscious have actually given me a 20% off discount code for you guys to use, which I'll put down below. All you have to do is put Dolly in at the checkout in capital letters and you get 20% off your order and that is valid till the end of March. Considering how much chocolate I've just eaten, I don't actually feel ill. I wouldn't eat that much in one go usually, maybe sometimes, but that was so good. Thank you so much for sitting here and watching me eat chocolate. Are you hungry now? Because I'm not. I love you guys so so much. If you like this video then please give it a big chocolatey thumbs up. I release new videos every Thursday and don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below to join the Doll Squad. Doll Squad strong and I'll see you guys in the next video or in my next stream. Bye guys!